Okay, well, this uh, video is for uh, my sister and also a granddad and also a brilliant guy named Greg Zumwaltz. And um, I follow granddad's work really close because he and I uh, are interested in the same stuff. And he has used this Ender 3D printer in a lot of different ways. And one of the ways that uh, caught my attention was a design by this gentleman here of a wind-up spring car, a plastic car, built on a 3D printer and then you just assemble it. And uh, <clears throat> anyway, I've been watching Granddad's work on this uh, project here and decided I would at least make the spring part of it and take a look and see what that's like. I'll give a link to the gentleman's uh, YouTube website and stuff and then uh, I'll give a link to granddad's um, video relating to this but the more I researched this gentleman here Greg's uh, work it's brilliant I mean it's uh, it's pure engineering on a scale I've never seen before and Becky um, this 3d printer has been a great learning tool for me and I sure appreciate the gift but it reminds me of what you were telling me about CAD um, computer aid design way back when we were working for our, uh, the aerospace company. I think it was Boeing or McDonnell Douglas. I think Boeing worked for, I don't remember, maybe it was McDonnell Douglas. But the design work that this guy shows in his videos uh, reminds me of what you must have learned way back when. But after this project here, um, it uh, came out real nice, and I 3D printed uh, the rotor, the supports, and the base, and then bought the clear piece here. Um, I inspired me to look at energy storage, and on this one here, it uses solar energy and stored it in a supercapacitor. This project here, the energy is stored in a spring, and it's stored in a plastic spring that's made out of this uh, PLA plastic filament that um, they say that uh, it will break eventually but I just wanted to see what that looks like uh, and printed up a spring you know, using this uh, 3D printer process but anyway this is uh, kind of what I'm looking at right now is uh, energy storage in a printed spring thanks for watching